Hello, this is Cheryl Arias Wicker with Christian Movie Connect, and we are at the red carpet premiere of Inspiration Pop 2929. And right now, we're speaking with country music legend Larry Gatlin. Okay, so how did you get involved in this film? My wife Janice and I were eating at the Athens restaurant. Now, it's either 8th Street or 12th Street. I always get them mixed up over now. And we overheard these two guys talking about this movie they were making and about they needed some music and one of the actors what was supposed to write some of it and this. And I just, I wasn't really eavesdropping, but I just heard it. So I went over to them and said, hey, uh, my name's Larry Gatlin. I write songs. And they went, <sighs> well, they didn't. They weren't really that. <laughs> But we talked about it, you know, what it was about. And I loved the story, loved what it was about. And uh, they said, hey, come be a little part of it. Yeah. So I can't wait to see it. I haven't seen any uh, trailers or anything for it. So uh, I'm uh, I'm going to be surprised uh, like everybody else. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Well, what about the part attracted you? Well, they just said, uh, told me a little bit about it. Thank you. And I said, hey, that's cool, you know, kind of a... A mysterious kind of cat, maybe a little bit of a mentor or something, or you know, using. Uh, really, they said it's about an old dude, oh. and I said, "Hey, I can do that." <laughs> you know, who sings a song that might kind of help uh, inspire a young man or, or kind of help him a little bit on his way. So that that attracted me, and the fact that it was a faith-based uh, a movie and you know something to uh, meant to inspire and uplift people. I, I think that's what we ought to be about. I really do. Yeah. Was there a special moment for you on this film? Well, I, I'm, I haven't seen it. The whole thing's going to be a special moment. I didn't want to. I wanted to do my part, let them put it together. Uh, I think that would have ruined it for me. I mean, I was glad to go down there. Uh, the young man, when you see this kid act, he, I mean, he gets it. He really gets it, and, and the emotion, the range of emotion uh, that he showed uh, during the whole thing. I mean, they've been telling me about it. I had the script. You know, I read it a long time ago. But uh, it, this this is going to be a this going to be a very this going to do a lot of people a lot of good. Yeah, yeah. Well, what are you hoping that people will get out of this uh, film when they when it, when they see it in theaters? Well, you know, my brothers and I have a our mission statement is to uplift people, to entertain people, and to make money. <laughs> I hope this one does all three of those. That's a good thing. I mean, what better thing in life to think that you've entertained your fellow man and uplift them for a little while and made some money, put the people to work, and you know, so they could go buy gasoline, food, and bread, and taters, and bologna, and the whole thing, pay their rent. It's a good deal. Okay. Well, very good. Well, so good to meet you, and hope God you best. enjoy seeing yourself. Nice to see you. Okay. All right. Thanks. Thanks.